Catholic Daily Mass Readings May 28, 2024 Tuesday of the 8th week in Ordinary Time A reading from the first letter of St. Peter Beloved, concerning the salvation of your souls, the prophets who prophesied about the grace that was to be yours searched and investigated it investigating the time and circumstances that the spirits of christ within them indicated when it testified in advance to the sufferings destined for christ and the glories to follow them it was revealed to them that they were serving not themselves but you with regard to the things that have now been announced to you by those who preach the good news to you through the Holy Spirit sent from heaven, things into which angels longed to look. Therefore, gird up the loins of your mind, live soberly, and yet your hopes completely on the grace to be brought to you at the revelation of Jesus Christ. Like obedient children, do not act in compliance with the desires of your former ignorance, but as he who called you is holy. Be holy yourselves in every aspect of your conduct, for it is written, Be holy because I am holy. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsor Psalm, let our response be, the Lord has made known His salvation. Sing to the Lord a new song, for He has done wondrous deeds. His right hand has won victory for Him, His holy arm. The Lord has made known His salvation. The Lord has made His salvation known in the sights of the nations. He has revealed His justice. He has remembered his kindness and his faithfulness toward the house of Israel. The Lord has made known his salvation. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation by our God. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lands. Break into song, sing praise. The Lord has made known his salvation. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Peter began to say to Jesus, We have given up everything and followed you. Jesus said, Amen, I say to you, There is no one who has given up house or brothers or sisters or mother or father or children or lands for my sake and for the sake of the Gospel who will not receive a hundred times more now in this present age. Then he embraced the children and blessed them, placing his hands on them. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to Lord Jesus Christ.